and welcome to the Van Life Pantry Nomadic Pantry Podcast, where we talk all things food, cooking, kitchen, pantry storage, and life on the road for vehicle nomads. I am just driving by to give you a short today. I fight against myself all the time about whether it's worth it to do a short or whether I should give longer, more in-depth information. And I fight with myself about the lack of perfection that will result. And I end up not giving you information that I should just be giving. Uh, Life is not perfect. And it's, as I've said so many times, it's not going to be perfect. So here I am to tell you that if you don't have a high top vehicle, or if you don't have a class A, B, or C RV, and you perhaps don't have a kitchen build inside your vehicle, you probably carry a tent with you. And if you don't, you should. And if that tent is not tall enough to stand up in, it should be. Because what you can do is put the tent up as a mess tent. Especially if you're boondocking in the desert for the winter, or if you're in a long-term vehicle access area where you can leave the tent up and you can set up a kitchen tent. It can be extremely useful and uh, as long as you have good ventilation, I have had no trouble using my camp stove inside the tent. However, let me tell you that I am in no way advocating that that is the correct way to use a camp stove, nor am I saying that I would accept any liability for your use of said stove that causes damage to your tent or other belongings. Do your own diligent research about whether you should or should not cook inside the tent. The mess tent by itself is a good idea just for pantry storage, for standing up, for prep. You can do prep work in there. You can have your table set up. You can do all of your cutting, all of your, um, you know, staging of items to cook. And even if you are still cooking outside, you can use the mess tent very effectively. Uh, I definitely recommend two types of stove. I definitely recommend a backpacker stove with a uh, perhaps the butane mix type fuel. It tends to have higher BTU and cooks faster. We use a backpacker type stove almost exclusively for heating water to make coffee or hot tea or other hot drinks. Um, And the separate cooking stove is a regular suitcase style uh, butane stove. But I have learned that propane lasts longer. So uh, there is a propane, there's a, there are a few dual fuel stoves on the market. Those are definitely worth a look and uh, worth the money if you can pick one of those up as an initial investment. Over the long run, it is less expensive if you can outfit it with a five gallon propane tank and use that. So again, the propane tank, when you're using it, you probably want that outdoors. You want to make sure that you're storing it safely and properly when you aren't using it. And uh, if you can store it outside, that is a really good thing. Or if you have an um, undercarriage or something that you can store it, that's a very good thing. Anyway, I just wanted to stop in and say mess tent can make all the difference. And uh, if it's windy, you definitely want to do what I recently did, which is purchase rebar steel tent stakes. I find them absolutely amazing, especially for very hard desert ground. So I hope you all are having a great day. I hope you are enjoying the road and eating well. I will catch you next time. Enjoy the day.